Now, she is the best-selling classical artist of the century and a voice known across the world. Now, Catherine Jenkins is preparing to spread some Christmas cheer for charity. Let's have a listen and a sing-along. Oh, oh, they just cut the chorus. Catherine joins us now. <laughs> Good to see you this morning. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was just about I was just about to join in. Do you fancy a duet single sometime, Catherine? Uh, absolutely. We, well, we could definitely do karaoke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, karaoke is probably my limit. To be fair, it is really good to see you this morning. Talk us about this this show that you're spreading to hospitals. Uh, well, I created a film um, that we made at the Royal Albert Hall, which is called uh, Catherine Jenkins' Christmas Spectacular, and the sort of the message of that was really trying to bring some Christmas cheer to families out there at the end of a tough year, you know, when they were talking in the news potentially about Christmas concerts and carol services not happening, I thought, you know, we, ha we have to have this, we have to get Christmas music out to people. So we made a, fe uh, a feature film um, full of all of the music from traditional to contemporary Christmas songs and dance and special guests. Um, and we've been working with an amazing charity called uh, Medicinema, who um, show the uh, show films in hospitals to patients, outpatients, um, and to NHS uh, staff. And so it's lovely to think that they'll get to see the film and hopefully it will bring them a little bit of respite and comfort and, and Christmas cheer. I know it'll surprise you, Catherine, but I am an old cynic. I've been in this job for too long. And so I see... When I, when I read things like this, I sometimes think, oh, is that really going to cheer anybody up? Since we've been playing your clips this morning, I've been singing my head off in every commercial break. It really does work, doesn't it? It brings a smile to our faces to see this. Uh, you know, uh, Christmas music is amazing in that, you know, it brings us, it brings us joy, it, um, peace a sense of nostalgia, wonderful memories. Um, it warms the heart. And, and um, I wanted this to be a sort of, you know, a feel-good, old-fashioned family-style um, film with, you know, special guests and sort of all of those, uh, those songs that are emotional and, and, and warm our hearts. And I had such amazing fun making this. You know, we had only a few days to film this at the Royal Albert Hall. It's not a concert by any stretch. It's a, it's a story. It's almost like a night at the museum, but it's a Christmas Eve at the Royal Albert Hall. And in this fantasy world, me and the family live there, of course. Right. <laughs> and uh, the Albert Hall comes to life on Christmas Eve, you know, with with so many other things. We've, we've got, you know, Bill Nye, Vanessa Redgrave, Sir Bryn Terville. Um, we've got the Royal, uh, Royal Air Force Regiment Band. We've even got the Sugar Plum Fairy, which is a massive delight to my daughter. <laughs> I have to say, the, of the clips we've been showing, you in that red dress sweeping down the corridors um, is just fabulous, cos it is, it is sort of so old-fashioned, so traditional. That's, it's like a, something from the silver screen. Well, actually, I referenced quite a lot of, you know, I grew up um, being a massive fan of people like Judy Garland and Judy Andrews, um, looking through some of those amazing Hollywood specials. Um, and what was also incredible was the Royal Albert Hall gave us such amazing access. So we were able to film, um, you know, not just on the stage, but on the roof and in the basement and the boxes and the backstage. And I, I spent quite a lot of time in the Royal Albert Hall, but I learned about spaces that I didn't know existed there. And so it's really nice to be able to share all of that with the viewer. Yeah. Uh, look, when is Medi Cinema showing this? Oh, I believe it's showing it now. I mean, it's in it's in normal cinemas um, across the UK uh, this month, um, and it's out on DVD, and you can see it on digital platforms. I wanted to make it accessible to as many people as possible, in that if you don't feel like you can venture out of your home, then, of course, you can see it in the normal way you'd watch a film. But it's just really lovely to think that this is also going into hospitals um, and, you know, really going to the people who I think need it most, um, and I really hope that it brings them some, some festive fun and, and Christmas cheer. Yeah. It just is. It just is. I just know it is. Um, Catherine, go on then. Do us a favour. I'm dreaming of a I'm white dreaming of a white Christmas. Christmas. Go, your life. Just like <laughs> the ones I used to know. <laughs> You've got a great voice. 
voice. You actually have a great voice. I, I, I let, yeah, okay, let's talk. Oh. <laughs> we'll definitely have to do something. That was hey, a good scene. Whatever happens in my life, I've done the duet with Catherine Jenkins. Really good to see you this morning. Thank you very much indeed. You too. <laughs> Thanks Can't for having me on.